Hello and welcome to the Critic Eculus. I'm the Monk, and today we are talking all about the Empire of Sin. And there is a patch coming up in February. 1.03 is releasing. There are four things that I would like to talk about about this. I'm very excited for. Number one, they are changing safe house rushing. That's right, you are no longer going to be able to rush the safe houses from the get-go in the game. It's going to make it a little bit longer, a little bit harder. Basically, they are hiding the locations of these safe houses um and you kind of have to do some legwork to actually discover where their safe houses are um now personally i think this is a big win i think it's a game changer i definitely think it's going to help to extend gameplay um just a little bit so that was number one number two the ai characters within this game are actually getting stronger so not only now are the safe houses hidden but the safe houses, when you actually hit them, are going to be tougher than ever before. Not only the safe houses, but every racket the boss owns. If they level it up, the AI with inside it is going to be getting more HP. They're going to be able to use the equipment that they get a little bit better and just be generally a little bit smarter, a little bit tougher. And again, I really think this is going to help with gameplay, help extend that gameplay right now. Um, it means we're not going to be able to rush it quite as much. I'm hoping, um, depending on how it actually plays out, uh, I actually think this is going to be another really good point. So number three now is that the big confirmation that auto-resolving battles is a thing. It will be a thing. It may not be within this patch, but it is definitely going to happen. I think from what I read through the patch notes uh, is that it will be within this coming patch. It just won't be the full version. There's going to be an element in it, um, but it's really good to see that this auto-resolve is actually happening then we needed it we needed it bad it was one of the worst things about this game if you ask me is being bombed and bombed and bombed by hits from other bosses when they went to war with you they would hit like six seven rackets at the same time back to back almost no way of getting out of that loop unless you paused and you fast traveled and you paused and you fast traveled you paused and you fast traveled and it went on until you managed to beat all of their their rackets or their people or their hit squads. But of course, that does bring us to point number four. Point number four, guys, is that they are removing fast travel. That's correct. You will no longer be able to fast travel from point to point on the map. Where it was, was, you could fast travel to, for instance, a racket, take it over, fast travel to the next racket, take it over. There was no need to run around the map. There was no immersion whatsoever. It was skipping out so much of the gameplay that will be removed with this upcoming patch. Now, what it means is that you'll still be able to use the taxis from taxi to taxi. You'll still be able to go to your safe house. So having a safe house in the neighborhoods that you take over some people beforehand, they weren't bothering to get that second safe house and assigning a lieutenant to it, for instance. Well, that second safe house is now going to be quite important and it will you know, help you or be there for you to fast travel to it. So they were my four key takes from those notes that I just flashed up on the screen. Now, I'll put a link in the description down below um, where you can find that text, that information. Obviously, that comes from the Empire of Sin um, main website. I will put that down there and you can have a little look through, a little read through of it yourselves. Uh, like I said, this patch is coming out in February, so it is real soon now, just maybe a couple of weeks away. Um, I, for one, I'm really looking forward to this. Um, I recently announced that I I f did actually get um, made a member of the family. I've become a made man, so I get to you know help tweak and give suggestions about how this game you know could look in the future. I personally am really excited to see these changes actually come out and open. 
Um, I think the uh, no fast travel one and the auto resolve are the biggest takes from those patches. Now remember guys, this is just the first update of the year. There's going to be loads more to come, um, but it's really good to see that this game is being tweaked. It's a game that I personally absolutely love, and I know that many people on my channel um, play this game, really, really enjoy it, and want there to be improvements as well. And uh, it's good to see that these improvements are finally happening. But guys, this was just a really short video, just kind of let you know that they've kind of let slip about things that are going to be happening in the game. Let me know down in the comments what you would most like to see changed, or maybe the change that you're most excited to see coming this February. But if you have enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit that like button, and of course, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. That way you won't miss out on more Empire of Sin content just like this. But guys, hope you have a good one and I'll see you in the next video.